Phoebe Cates, a prominent figure in the world of cinema, has left an indelible mark on audiences with her compelling performances. Whether you first encountered her on screen in a memorable role or have a cherished personal memory associated with her work, Kate's impact is undeniable. Reflect on the first time you watched a production featuring this iconic actress, or recall a special moment linked to her performances. We invite you to share your most cherished memories or personal experiences with Phoebe Cates in the comments below. Your stories contribute to the collective appreciation of this classic Hollywood actor. Share your thoughts and reminisce about the moments that have made Phoebe Cates a lasting presence in cinematic history. Phoebe Cates, a name that resonates with the charm of the silver screen, embarked on her journey into the world of acting with a magnetic allure that transcended traditional boundaries. Born on July 16, 1963, in New York City, Phoebe Kathleen Cates began her artistic ascent with a background as diverse as it was intriguing. Before gracing the Hollywood scene, Phoebe was already carving her niche in the modeling industry, catching the discerning eyes of renowned photographers, and making waves in the world of fashion. However, it was her transition to acting that truly set the stage for her enduring legacy. Cates made her cinematic debut in 1982 in the coming-of-age classic, Fast Times at Ridgemont High, directed by Amy Heckerling. Her portrayal of Linda Barrett, the alluring and confident character, catapulted her into the limelight and etched her name in the annals of cinematic history. The iconic pool scene, with Cates emerging from the water, became a defining moment not only for the film but also for her career. While Fast Times at Ridgemont High launched her into stardom, Phoebe Cates showcased her versatility in subsequent roles. In 1984, she captivated audiences in the romantic comedy Gremlins, displaying a delightful blend of humor and charisma. Her ability to seamlessly transition between genres showcased the depth of her talent. Beyond the glitz of Hollywood, Phoebe Cates' personal life added layers to her narrative. In 1989, she married actor Kevin Kline, marking the beginning of a steadfast partnership that endured the challenges of showbiz. The couple has two children, and their enduring love story stands as a testament to the resilience of relationships in the tumultuous world of entertainment. Despite her early success, Phoebe Cates chose to step back from acting to prioritize her family. Her decision to focus on her personal life demonstrated a rare commitment to balance in an industry often fraught with demands. However, even during her hiatus, her influence lingered in the hearts of fans who fondly remembered her contributions to the silver screen. In retrospect, Phoebe Caddis' journey is one marked by elegance, talent, and the courage to chart her own course. Her impact on the cinematic landscape goes beyond the characters she portrayed, extending into the realm of inspiration for aspiring actors and actresses. In closing, Phoebe Cates remains a captivating figure in the tapestry of Hollywood, her legacy defined not only by her on-screen presence, but also by the choices she made and the barriers she broke. Her story is a testament to the enduring power of talent, resilience, and the ability to gracefully navigate the ever-evolving currents of the entertainment industry. Phoebe Cates, a name forever etched in the stars of Hollywood, met her future husband, Kevin Kline, when she auditioned for the role of Chloe in The Big Chill that eventually went to Meg Tilly. In a twist of fate that would shape her personal life, Phoebe Cates crossed paths with Kevin Kline during auditions for The Big Chill. Though she didn't secure the role of Chloe, which eventually went to Meg Tilly, this encounter marked the beginning of a significant chapter in her life. The connection formed during that audition session blossomed into a lasting relationship, leading to their marriage in 1989. This union with Kevin Klein not only defined her personal life, but also became a cornerstone of stability amid the unpredictable currents of the entertainment industry. Phoebe's journey from that audition room to Hollywood stardom, and eventually a loving partnership, underscores the unpredictable nature of destiny in the world of acting. It's a reminder that sometimes, the most profound moments occur off-camera, shaping the narratives that extend far beyond the silver screen. Phoebe Cates shares a unique connection with actress Jennifer Jason Lee, forged on the set of Fast Times at Ridgemont High. Their friendship, born during the filming process, highlights the camaraderie that can blossom in the world of Hollywood. Beyond the scripted scenes, genuine bonds can form, impacting lives in ways unseen by the audience. 
Additionally, Phoebe Cates played a role beyond the silver screen as the inspiration for the character Ayukawa Madoka in Kimagure Orange Road, a popular manga series, an animated show. The creator, Izumi Matsumoto, drew from Kate's essence to shape a character that resonated with audiences, showcasing the actress influence extending into different realms of entertainment. Diving into her roots, it's interesting to note that Phoebe's paternal grandparents were Jewish emigrants from Podolia, Ukraine. Her mother's diverse heritage adds another layer to her background, being born in Shanghai, China, with a mix of Russian Jewish and Chinese descent. This unique blend of cultural influences contributes to the rich tapestry of Phoebe Caddis' personal history. In conclusion, whether forming lasting friendships on set, inspiring characters in anime, or carrying a cultural legacy, Phoebe Caddis' impact reaches beyond the Hollywood spotlight. These facets provide a glimpse into the multifaceted persona of an actress whose influence extends far beyond her cinematic roles. Before making a mark in Hollywood, Phoebe Cates had a stint as a teen model in the pages of Seventeen magazine, showcasing her versatility beyond acting. Her transition from modeling to the silver screen added depth to her career, setting the stage for her enduring legacy. In addition to her acting prowess, Cates demonstrated her musical talent by singing the theme song for the adventure romance movie Paradise, a subtle yet noteworthy aspect of her multifaceted career. These early experiences paved the way for her cinematic journey, highlighting the diverse skills that contributed to her success. From the pages of fashion magazines to the melodies of movie credits, Phoebe Cates left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. Phoebe Cates, hailing from a diverse background, began her career with a stint in the modeling industry before making a significant mark in Hollywood. Beyond her cinematic achievements, her personal life has been marked by a lasting partnership with actor Kevin Kline, with whom she shares two children. However, Caddis' journey extends far beyond the silver screen. In a unique twist of fate, Kate's crossed paths with Kevin Kline during auditions for The Big Chill, a role she didn't secure but led to a lasting relationship and eventual marriage in 1989. Their union stands as a testament to stability amid the unpredictable currents of the entertainment industry. Caddis' connections in Hollywood go beyond scripted scenes. She shares a genuine friendship with actress Jennifer Jason Lee, forged on the set of Fast Times at Ridgemont High. Additionally, she served as the inspiration for the character Ayukawa Madoka in Kimagure Orange Road, showcasing her influence beyond the silver screen. Diving into her roots, Phoebe's paternal grandparents were Jewish emigrants from Podolia, Ukraine, and her mother's diverse heritage adds another layer to her background, being born in Shanghai, China, with a mix of Russian Jewish and Chinese descent. This unique blend of cultural influences contributes to the rich tapestry of Phoebe Caddis' personal history. Before Hollywood fame, Kate's worked as a teen model in Seventeen magazine, showcasing her versatility. Her transition from modeling to acting added depth to her career, and she even demonstrated her musical talent by singing the theme song for the adventure romance movie Paradise. Post-retirement from films, Kate's and Kevin Klein divide their time between a country estate in upstate New York and a luxury penthouse in Manhattan's Upper East Side. Her post-film life involves supporting her husband's stage and film work, attending openings and benefits, and hosting dinner parties with celebrity friends. In her early days, Kate's had a job as a plainclothes security person at Gallery Drug Store at the age of 15. Despite catching only one elderly woman stealing band-aids, she didn't turn her in, showcasing a glimpse of her practical and compassionate nature. In conclusion, Phoebe Caddis' journey encompasses a diverse career, enduring relationships, and a multifaceted impact on and off the silver screen. Her story is one of talent, resilience, and the ability to navigate the unpredictable currents of the entertainment industry. As we bid adieu to this captivating journey through the cinematic realms of Phoebe Cates, I encourage you to pause and ponder the profound impact she's had on the tapestry of entertainment. As the curtains draw to a close, take a moment to reflect on the personal threads that bind you to this talented actress. Phoebe Cates, a luminary in the world of film, has effortlessly woven herself into the fabric of our memories with her compelling performances. From the silver screen to the recesses of our hearts, her artistry has left an indelible mark. What memories, what emotions, does the mere mention of her name evoke for you? 
This is not just a farewell, it's an invitation to share your cherished recollections, your favorite scenes, and the resonant lines that have lingered in your thoughts. In this communal tapestry of admiration, your voice becomes a vibrant thread, contributing to the rich narrative of appreciation for Phoebe Cates. Whether it's the nostalgia of fast times at Ridgemont High or the timeless allure of gremlins, each cinematic encounter with Phoebe Cates has been a shared experience. So, dear reader, what's your story? What moments of hers are etched in your memory, shaping your cinematic journey? As we collectively celebrate the artistic legacy of Phoebe Cates, let your words echo in the corridors of this virtual space. Share your thoughts, memories, and reflections. Let the discourse become a kaleidoscope of perspectives, a testament to the enduring impact of an actress who transcends time. In closing, I extend heartfelt gratitude for your time and interest in this exploration of Phoebe Cates' cinematic magic. May her performances continue to reverberate in the echoes of your movie nights and inspire conversations for years to come. Until our narratives intertwine again, thank you and farewell.